Standing here at the back of 1856 Osprey Bluff, you've got a fantastic pool here with the children's fence around it. Gives you just the safety of knowing that there's not going to be anything um, getting into the pool unless you want it to. Here on the left is an outdoor shower. Beautiful spot just to have a quick shower or hose off if you've been out in the yard cutting the grass. Half an acre, fully fenced as you can see. Back here we have a, a nice uh, playground and then to the right yeah, you get a little view of the shed way in the back there just to give you another idea of just how large this half acre is. The pool is eight feet deep. You actually have a nice diving board right here. There's also an automatic pool cleaner. So it's a piece of cake to keep up with the pool. You get a nice view of the back. Notice all the sliding glass doors and the windows along the back. So you have just really beautiful views from the house. Here on the left is your banana grove. There's some small bananas growing there. It's such a private neighborhood. Everything is very quiet. All the neighbors are fantastic. You have beautiful palm trees that are surrounding the back here. And then again, all the privacy. You can see there's just absolutely no one back here to bother you when you're out enjoying the pool. One of the most private backyards that you'll find. Right over here is the covered lanai. This is a great spot to invite your friends and guests over. You've got the flat screen TV up on the wall. In the cabinet back there, we have a refrigerator for the drinks to provide. Great sized um, table and then a, an outdoor ceiling fan. On the other side of this fence, you actually have another fence for your property line. So this is just a, a privacy thing right there. Uh, mounted outdoor speakers, indoor outdoor speakers right up here. So perfect time to put on the music when you're enjoying the pool outside. We have plenty of birds and hummingbirds that love to come and enjoy the backyard just as much as the owners do. And again, the boat um, slip is only a few houses down, so you can hop on your boat, drive over to Whitey's for an afternoon, have some dinner, and come back by boat if you prefer. Or if you do, would like to walk, it's only a two-minute walk cutting through the neighborhood to get over to the restaurant.